While we have explored a number of ways to interact between the modular and the computer, one toolset that we have not yet examined is Silent Way from Expert Sleepers. Designed to work with any VST host application, the Silent Way collection has a number of useful devices. I found it particularly handy with Ableton Live, with the added modular flexibility of Max for Live. Silent Way is a set of plugins which can be used as modulation tools alongside your modular system with any DC-coupled audio interface, like the ES8. The bundle ranges from more straightforward plugins, like DC, a direct current offset tool, or LFO, a two-channel complex LFO and random source. Others get complicated, performing calibration of oscillators and more. Let's take the DC plugin and use it to assign a MIDI controller to a function in our system. First, I'll make sure Ableton is set to output through the ES8, as I don't want to send high DC signals through my studio monitors. I'll load the Silent Way DC plugin onto an audio track, and try turning the output knob. Notice the rising signal in the channel meter. I'll connect a MIDI controller to the computer, and make sure it's enabled as a remote input device in the Ableton preferences. I'll hit Command-M, or the MIDI button in the upper right-hand corner of the app, and click on the bipolar DC offset listed as output negative 1 to 1. I'll turn the knob I want to assign to this function on the controller, and they should automatically connect. Now I can patch from output 1 on the ES8 to anywhere on our system, and control that parameter via the MIDI controller. We can send the DC offset outputs to any of the channels on the ES8 by selecting the appropriate listing in the Audio 2 menu in Ableton. This way each pair of outputs can perform different, independent functions. Any parameter in the Silent Way software can be easily assigned to mappable Max for Live MIDI plugins as well like the handy LFO MIDI tool, or the hands-free controller app Leap Modulation, which we explored previously. What apps are you using to communicate between your computer and modular systems? Tell us about it in the comments. Thanks for watching and sharing. As always, please like, follow, and subscribe. And remember, patch smarter.